Hey guys, I just harvested the radishes. I'm so excited. They are so beautiful. I believe that part of the reason why I love gardening so much is just seeing that nature can produce these incredible shades of color. So I'm gonna show you how gorgeous these radishes are. Now we're gonna be harvesting some broccoli, the first of the season. These broccoli loved the cool weather and they love to be covered. Let's harvest some broccoli. Is it good? Mm-hmm. Yeah? I'm so glad. Oh my God, it's so good, it's delicious. So, they're not giant, but I wanted to harvest them before they went to flower. They looked like they were pretty good, oh my God. So year after year, I seem to underestimate the size that tomatoes get. So I'm just gonna put this one plant in this, in this planter here so it has plenty of room to get bigger. So I just got the peas in the ground that my mother-in-law gave me and we'll see how they do. I'm also going to plant some from seed um, in the same bed here. Now I'm going to be planting some lettuce that I started from seed a while back and never got around to actually planting it. So I'm gonna get these in the ground and see how they do. Yay, so I got those planted. Now I'm gonna be planting purple carrots my favorite for real these are purple dragon carrots they're gorgeous carrots are so easy to grow sometimes most of the time they're easy to grow um so yeah let's plant some carrots I love carrots so these seeds are extremely tiny super duper tiny so when you're planting super tiny stuff you don't have to bury them too deep i just like to sprinkle Try. I'm not really a perfectionist about planting. And then you just lightly cover them. Okay, so last but certainly not least, I'm gonna be planting cucumbers this year. It's a Boston pickling cucumber and a Wisconsin pickling cucumber. So we'll see how they do. I'm just putting them in this shelf thing that was in our chicken coop and it wasn't being used, so now it's a planter. All right, let's plant some cucumbers. 